Those flags, man, get you every time. Uh, guys, after dropping their last two straight, the West Side Seminoles looking to get the home cooking going once again tonight at the Ed DeForest Sports Complex. They hosted the Baldwin Braves. The Knolls opened the second half, leading this thing 13 to 6. Micah Welch and the Braves looking to change that. Baldwin's highly touted running back living up to the name. Yeah, running right along with the entire West Side defense for a nice game. My goodness, fourth down on the goal line. The Braves are going to punch it in at the bottom of that pile. That will be a Baldwin score. They missed the PAT, though, so it's still a 13-12 West Side lead. West Side strikes right back. That's a nice pickup from James Neville to Tamir Lewis. They'll flip the field, start of the second quarter, punch it in. Kadivius Iverson around the outside, around the outside. Touchdown, Knowles. They go up 20-12. to How about the Baldwin response, though? They're going to give this thing to Micah Welch, and you know, he's, he's their guy, so why not give it to him? And he looks to be, as Marv would say, gone, gone, until right about here. The ball comes out on the goal line, but check this out. It's picked up by his guy. That's a touchdown for Baldwin. It, it counts the same. I don't think I've seen that all season. Uh, and suddenly, we're tied at 20. West Side trying to make their move late, though. Jesse Bell making it look way too easy. He is in for the score. The Knolls go up 27 to 20. FFN scoreboard. Baldwin made this thing interesting, but Westside comes out on top 41 to 20. 